Hi, I'm Mira from Flow with Mira YouTube channel. Today I've created small Pilates ball class for Bassy Pilates YouTube channel. The class is done in Bassy Pilates floor style created by Ryle Asakowitz. So let's grab your ball and meet me on a mat. Oh, we have an assistant today. Her name is Boki. She's going to make sure that I'm doing the class and the exercise in a great form, aren't you? All right. Let's come and sit down on the mat. I want you to sit in a diamond leg position, lifting the spine nice and tall, and let's go ahead and bring the ball in front of the chest like so. We inhale through the nose as we lengthen through the spine. We exhale through the mouth as we ground our pelvis down to the floor. Inhaling, exhaling, inhale, we feel the spine lengthening up light to the sky. Exhale, we deliberately draw in our pelvic floor, our deep abdominal, transverse abdominis to the spine. In breath. And exhale, press the ball and draw in the deep TVA muscle as you breathe out. Inhale, we lift. Stay nice and tall. Exhale, pressing the ball, keeping the shoulder nice and open, nice and down away from your ears. Inhale, stay long and tall. Exhale, pressing against the ball, into the ball. Last one, in breath. And exhale. Now straighten the arms long. Here, take an in breath. As we exhale, draw into the abdominal, go into your C curve here. Roll back, get the sacrum onto the floor, get the lower back onto the floor. In breath, hello, Boki. Exhale, rolling up into that C curve, and we'll lift the spine tall. Again, exhale, we pull into the abdominal, go into that C curve here. And we roll back. Can we get the sacrum down to the floor? Can we get the lower spine to the floor? Can you give me some space, Bogey, to go down to this ball? And exhale, roll up and over forward. And we'll lift up through the spine. I'm just gonna come forward a little bit more here. And let's go two more of that. Exhale, we pull in abdominal, go into that C curve shape. We roll back. I'm giving a little press against the ball here as I roll back so I can engage a little deeper in my upper abdominal. Exhale, come up and over forward. And lifting toe through the spine. Last one. Exhale, into that C curve. Then we roll back. Can we get the lower back onto the floor? And we stay there as we in breath. Exhale, we roll up and over into that C curve. And then we'll lift the spine nice and tall. Great. Now let's bring the ball between the knees here. How's my form, Boki? Looking good? Are my feet parallel? Are your feet parallel? Right, lifting up through the spine here. Let's try to bring the heel a little closer towards the pelvis. See if we can get ourselves really tight in the knee here, maybe. Take our arms forward and breathe that. Go into that C curve and go ahead and roll back. If you need some assistance, you can bring your hands underneath your thigh. So go back, go into the deep flexion. Right down to the floor. Okay, not too bad, Mira. And all the way down. Let's bring the feet slightly closer towards the pelvis. Let's go ahead into our pelvic curl. Take a deep breath. Exhale. 
deepening the abdominal, lengthening the lower back down to the floor, curl the pelvis and roll up through our spine, coming into our bridge position here. Inhale as we lengthen through our spine, sending the thighs towards the knee. Exhale as we roll down from the upper back, middle back, lower spine, and come back to a starting position here. In breath. Exhale, abdominal imprint in the lower spine. Then press the feet down, use the hamstring to continue articulating the spine up to that bridging position here. Keep the arms reaching to your feet. Press the pelvis up a little higher. Send your thigh to the knee in breath. Exhale, we roll down the spine. Vertebra by vertebra. Down to your starting position here. Let's do two more times. Inhale, exhale. Deep scoop in, in the abdominals and curl up, up 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 now press your arms a little bit more to the mat can we then lift the pelvis a little higher there in breath exhale softening through the chest lower ribs and lower back sacrum and back to your neutral pelvis again last one exhale Curling up, 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 and let's stay here. Lift the pelvis a little higher, opening up across the front of your hip here. And exhale, squeeze the ball. And inhale, slight release. Exhale, squeeze. In breath. And squeeze. In breath. And five more. Four, neck is long here. Three, two, one, we hold and exhale, we roll the spine back down to the floor and release. Now drop the ball, bring the ball underneath the foot away from me. Right. From here, as you breathe out, I want you to glide the leg away. So slide out, reaching the leg away from the pelvis. And inhale, come back in, ball underneath your foot. Exhale, reach. Inhale, come back. Exhale, reach. Inhale, come back. And two more, reach. Inhale, come back. Last one, reach and lengthen away. And come back. Now press that ball with that foot. Let's do some more pelvic curl. We breathe out. Exhale, deep scoop in the abdominal. And curl the pelvis up to that bridging position there. Take care that your pelvis should be in an even level there. And exhale, roll down, down. All oh, hamstrings, they're waking up. In breath. And exhale, press down as you curl up all the way. Find that bridge position there, even pelvis on the left and right. Exhale, roll down, down and release back to neutral let's do two more times exhale we roll up and press the arms curl the pelvis up oh yes hamstrings they are working in breath exhale roll down and release next one we're going to stay up here and roll up lift and stay now, slide the ball away, four, and bring it under, and hold the height of the pelvis, two, and bring it under, two more, and three, bring it under, last one, out, and bring it under, hold, let's roll the spine down, 
All right, let's switch sides. So ball on to underneath the other foot. We stretch the leg away, glide as we breathe that in breath. Exhale, glide out, in breath. You know what? Lift the head up for me and check if your pelvis is even. That's right. Make sure that the ears are on the level with the left and right. And come back one more time and slide out and bring the ball underneath the foot, ready for the pelvic curl. And we curl the pelvis, as you press the ball down, send the pelvis to the knee, press the arms, lift a little higher, in breath. Exhale, roll down. And back to starting position again, three more times. Exhale, press down as you curl. And articulate the spine as you come up. Inhale, find length through the spine. Fine. And exhale, melting down, vertebrae by vertebrae, and release. Again, two more times. Exhale, roll up. Inhale, create length, create space in between each segment of the vertebra. Exhale, deep flexion. One vertebra at a time. And release. Next one, we stay up. And exhale, roll up again. Press down to curl up, up, up. Then extend. And bring the ball underneath. And out two. And ball underneath. Two more. And underneath. Last one. And underneath, hold and wobble. Let's roll down all the way back to the floor. Great. All right. Grab the ball. Place the ball between your knees, feet together. Let's bring the hands into lace underneath the head here for our chest lift. Now, as you breathe out, Deflate the abdominal and lift the chest as you squeeze the ball. Inhale. Exhale. Release the ball and come down. Exhale. We lift, lift, lift. Squeezing the ball. Inhale. Find length. Exhale. Come down. Again. Exhale, squeeze and lift, lift, lift. Inhale, can we lift a little higher? Exhale, return two more times. And squeeze. Inhale, lengthening up. Exhale, come down. And Lift up again. Inhale. Now here, as you exhale, lift both feet up. Lift the leg up. Inhale, lower. Tap. Exhale. Keep the chest lift. Exhale. Inhale, tap. Exhale. So double leg toe taps here. And lift. And down. We can also call double leg lowering. And down. Two more. And down. Last one. And down. Place the feet down. Grab the back of your thighs. And lift the chest a little higher here. Now hold that new height. Transfer your arms back behind your height. Chest lift with rotation to me. We breathe. Center, other side. I'm still squeezing the ball here. And up, center, rotate, center, rotate. We need to get the shoulder blades off the floor. I'm thinking flexion, forward in rotation. Center, twist. One more each side, twist. 
and twist. Come back, rotate to mid stay. Reach your arms long. Little pulses for five, four, three, two, one. Come back to the center, lift the arms up, rotate to the other side, and we'll lift. Two, three, four, five. Come back to center, hands behind the head, and come on down. Brilliant. Open your arms up to a T position. Lifting both legs up to tabletop, squeezing the ball here. Feet together for our spine, twist supine over to me as we inhale. Anchor the shoulders. Exhale, come back to center. Inhale to you. Exhale. Inhale to me. Exhale. And to you. Exhale. Let's do one more each side to me here. From the waist, we rotate back. Last one. Exhale, come back, come back, come back. Grab the ball in your hands. Lower the feet down. Straighten one leg out, second leg out. Bring your arms overhead, ready for the roll-ups. We inhale to lift up. Exhale. We peel the spine up, going up and over forward into that C curve, keeping the neck rather long here. Exhale. We draw in the abdominal, go into deep flexion through the spine, lower spine, middle spine, and then return the arms overhead. We go again. Inhale, chest lift. Exhale. Roll up into that C curve. Pull back in the abdominals, reach forward with the arms. And exhale as we melt the sacrum down. Lower spine, middle spine, upper spine, neck, head down, arms overhead. Two more times, please. Inhale, chest lift. Exhale. Seeker. Inhale. Nice and long through the spine. Exhale, we roll back. Arms overhead. Last one here. Inhale, lift. Exhale, peel up and over into that C curve. C curve, C curve. Brilliant. And lift the spine tall. Now, let's get the ball underneath the legs. We're going to do our rolling like a ball. So we're going to do two versions of this. We have the ball underneath the legs here. Now, press your hands against your legs and find your balance here. Your feet are off the floor. So try to really guard your legs here by using those arm muscles. My biceps are actually working very hard here. All right, when you're ready, inhale. Roll to the shoulder, exhale, we balance. Inhale. Exhale, you really want to squeeze that ball behind your legs. Exhale, two more times, in breath. Exhale, last one. Exhale, we balance, balance. Now grab the ball, bring the ball between the chest and your thigh. All right, we're going to lock the legs here. We're going to inhale, roll back. Exhale, come up and over and balance. Again, inhale. Exhale. And three more. Exhale, look down towards the ball. Two more. Last one. Balance. Balance, balance, and release the feet. Great. Bring the ball underneath your thoracic. How's it going, my assistant? How am I doing here? All right, let's get the ball underneath your middle back. 
right feet down, parallel position, interlace your hands behind your head here. So adjust the position of the ball to a place that suits you best when you go over the ball into an extension. So we inhale, arch over the ball. I'm just gonna slide up a little bit. There we go. Now from here, exhale, lift the chest and curl forward. Inhale, keeping the neck nice and long. Arch over the ball. Hello. Exhale. We'll lift. And in breath, we arch over the ball. Exhale. We'll lift. Now inhale, arch over the ball again. As you come up, lift the leg closer to me up to a tabletop. And lift. Inhale, lower, extend over the ball. Exhale. Inhale, lower, extend over the ball. Exhale. One more like so. Exhale. Now this time, extend the leg forward like single leg stretch as you extend your back over the ball. Exhale, pull in. And extend forward, arch over the ball. And lift. And two more. Lift. Last one. And we'll lift. We're going to add some rotation here. So we extend over the ball and extend the leg forward and rotate to the knee as we lift. Inhale, as if we're doing crisscross. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Exhale. Last one. Exhale. Come back to center. Lower the foot down. We arch over the ball. We lift the chest and lift the other leg up to tabletop. Inhale, lower. Exhale. Inhale, lower. And arch over the ball. Exhale. And two more. And last one. For the single leg stretch, extend the leg forward and arch over. And come. Stretch the leg forward and arch over the ball. Exhale. Two more. Last one. Let's add the rotation and reach out. We twist as we come up and reach out. And rotate to the knee as we come up. Now, can we think about more flexion here? So I'm going to lift my chest in rotation, but I'm going to flex forward as much as I can. And one more. Lift, flex forward, forward, forward. Come back to center and lower the foot down. We're going to arch over the ball, stretch the leg closer to me on the floor, straight down. And we'll lift the leg as we lift the chest. Inhale. Reach down. Exhale. Lift up. Inhale. Reach down. Exhale. Two more. Last one. Lower the leg. Bring the foot in. Switch the other leg out. And... We'll lift. Inhale, lower and arch over the ball. And lift. 
Inhale. And in breath. Two more times. I'm trying to think of coming up higher off the ball as I progress with this exercise. And lower. Now we're going to come up again. Lift up. Stay. Reach your arm long in front of you. Straighten the other leg down. And then let's do some bicycle. We lower, change. Out. And change. And switch. And switch. And switch. And switch. One more set. Last set. We stay. Little pulses. We come forward. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Switch. And extend. And lift. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Bend both knees. Lower the feet down. And arch over the ball. Stretch your arms overhead and just give the abdomen a little break here. We inhale, expand the rib cage, exhale. Let's do one more of that. Inhale. As we exhale, lift the arms, lift the chest, and curl up to a chest lift again. Lift one leg up to tabletop, second leg's up to tabletop, stretch your leg up to the sky. Ready for the hundreds. We in breath. Exhale. And inhale. Three, four, five. Now, can we, as we exhale, lower the legs down to wherever you feel comfortable? Inhale, lifting back. And exhale. In breath. Exhale. In breath. Two more times. Last one. Well done. Bend the knee, grab the leg, lift the chest higher, drop the feet, curl up and rock yourself up. And open the legs, lift the spine tall. And breathe in breath. Exhale. Great. Grab the ball. Straighten the legs forward for our spine stretch here. So flex the feet. Sitting nice and tall here. Arms are forward. Balls in between your hands here. Take an in breath. Exhale. We roll down through the spine. We roll the ball on the floor here, go a little bit deeper into the hip flexion. Now we're going to add some extension. We're going to press the ball down, lengthening through the spine, sending the crown of the head reaching opposite direction from your sitting bone. Exhale, drawing the abdomen and roll up through the spine and come up to your starting position. Exhale, we roll down. And we roll the ball forward for a deeper hip flexion. Press down as we inhale. Lift the spine. Exhale. Roll back up to your starting position. Two more times. Exhale. Roll down. Roll the ball forward. Inhale. Press as we extend up back. Trying to keep a straight line here from my tailbone to the crown of my head. And rounding through my spine, we roll up tall. Last one. We roll down. Roll forward. And we press. We lift the spine tall, tall. Tall. Grab the ball and hold that spine. Lift the arms next to your ears. Some shoulder flexion here. We pull the arms back for 10, 9, 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We round our spine forward and we roll up tall. Okay, bring the ball, place in between your ankle here, bend the knees. We're going to transition ourselves down to the floor and we got our roll over. So sitting up nice and tall here, arms are forward. We roll back all the way down, arms down by the side, bring the legs up to a tabletop and lower the chest down. Extend the legs forward, bring the legs up to 90 degrees, press the arms and roll over. Dorsiflex the feet, lower the feet down to the floor and roll the spine down. Set that sitting bone down to the floor, point your feet, reach the leg away. Again, inhale, up to 90 and roll over. Keep the leg straight as much as you can. Dorsiflex, hip flexion, lower the legs. Roll down through the spine. Pelvis down, point of feet, reach away. Two more times, up we go. Roll over. We flex the feet, we lower the legs. We roll the spine down. Anchor the pelvis down, point of feet, reach the legs diagonally. And last one, up we go. Roll over. Flex. Lower, we roll down, pelvis down to the floor, point your feet, reach the legs away, bring the leg up to the sky again and rotate to me, inhale, exhale, inhale, over to you, exhale, two more each side and to me, exhale, keep the ball between your ankle, and over to you. Anchor your shoulders down. One more each side, in breath. Exhale. And last one. Exhale, let's go to our cord screw. To me as you inhale. Down, over to the other side. Back to center. Over to you. And then down, over to me. And back to center and to me, down, and center, and to you, and down, and center. Last set, in breath, and center. Last one, in breath, back to center. We bend the knee, lower the feet down, and turn your body, face me for the side lift. Keep the ball between your ankles still. Right, when you're ready, stretch your legs long. Chest nice and open, make sure there's a gap underneath your waistline. And we breathe out, lift the legs. In breath, lower and in breath, again, in breath, two more, in breath, last one will stay up, we hold, squeeze the ball, four, five, four, three, two, one, we lower, now from here, press the top arm down to the floor. Squeeze that ball between your legs here. And then we're gonna lift the underneath arms up and lower. And again, press down and lift and lower. It's a lot of oblique work here. And two more, press down, lift and down. Last one, press down and lift. And done, well done. All right, let's come up to sitting, bring the leg forward. 
Let's go to the other side. Right, for our side left. Right, align yourself. Long legs, long spine, long arm. Opened across the front of the chest. Lifting the underneath waistline. And we go up. And lower. And up. And lower. And up. Two more. And up. Last one. Stay up there. Little squeeze. And five. Four. Three. Two. One. And lower. All right. Let's press the top hand down. Squeeze the ball. And we'll lift. And down. Again. Press down. Lift. And down. You really need to get the top shoulder down towards your waistline. Two more. And down. Last one. Lift. And down. Brilliant. Okay. Let's take the ball out. Come up to a quadruped position and place the ball in between your knees. Lower half of your thighs there. Okay, align your hands and your shoulder. Align the knee, center of the hip here. Tuck the toes under for me. Take an in-breath. I want you to squeeze the ball and draw in your deep TVA muscle, your deep transverse abdominal muscle. And release. Again, two more. Exhale. Squeeze the inner thigh, squeeze the ball, and pull in your deep, deep TVA transverse abdominis, and release. Keep the spine nice and long. Exhale, and release. Now the next one, we're gonna squeeze again. Now float the knees off, and stay. Release the squeeze. And we squeeze for another 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and we lower. Release your ankle. Let's go ahead and do our cat stretch. We exhale, we round the spine. And through neutral, inhale, extend the upper back up to extension. And through neutral, exhale. In breath. Last set. And back to center. Brilliant. Let's grab the ball. Let's bring the ball on the back of your left leg. We're going to do some kneeling glute series here. So chest is nice and open. All right, from here. Let's do some hip extension with the bent knee. We in, exhale, we lift, inhale, we fall through the hip. Exhale. In breath. And. And down. Two more. And down. Last one here. And down. Now here I want you to extend or stretch your right arm forward, opposite arm, and lift the arm and the leg. And lower down. And lift. And definitely challenge your stability even more by lifting the arm up. Two more. Last one. We stay up. Little pulses for 10. Two, three, four, five, six. Don't lose the ball. Seven, 
eight, sh, nine, sh, ten, sh, and lower. Hands back down. Now over to the side, up. Sh, put hip up, abduction. Two, sh, and three. Sh, two more. Sh, last here. Sh, and then we add the arm. So opposite arm to the side and under. And two, using the ball. And under. Three, four. Last five, hold little pulses. Up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bring it in. All right, and switch the leg here. So we got the ball on the right leg. Okay. All right, let's go. Lift and lower. And two. Squeeze the ball. And three. Spine is long. Four. And five, then we're going to extend the opposite arm forward and lift and lower. Two and lower. Three, four. And last five, hold little pulses. Ten, nine, eight. Seven, six, I'm losing the ball here. All right, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and bring it down. Okay, let's go to the side. Let me just sort out this ball. All right, here we go. And out to the side, and under, and two, and under, and three, two more. Last one. All right, let's add the arms. So straight arm to the side as we open the leg out. And lower. And two. And lower. And three. And four. Last one, five. We stay. Little pulses. Up. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, and bring it under. Good job. Grab the ball, sit back for a moment, curl the pelvis under to your heels, and let's go onto our front here. Have the ball in front of you for our swan. Take the arms, take your hands on top of the ball, long arms. So you have a little press of the arms against the ball here. Neck is long. We inhale as we lengthen the spine. Exhale, drawing the shoulder blades down to the middle back and start lifting the spine up to a thoracic extension. And release down. And shoulder blades gliding down. And then pressing down onto the ball as we lift the spine up and release. Again, exhale, lifting, and breath. return. Exhale. Anchor your feet down. Keep sending your sitting bone down to your feet as you come up. Neck is long, chest is forward and up. And release. One last one here. And gather my shoulder blades down to my middle back first. Now pull up my abdominal, then pressing the ball down as I articulate upward through my spine to an extension. And Release. 
Okay, now transfer the ball between your ankles. Interlace the hands more of the back for our double leg kick here. Turn your head towards me. Okay, here we go. Exhale, three, two, one. Inhale, extending the legs away, reaching the spine long. Turn the head over to the other side and we do it again. Exhale, two, three, inhale, reach long. And turn to me, exhale, two, three, inhale, reach. And at the side, we go, two, three, inhale, reach. Last set, and go, inhale, reach. Last one. Inhale, reach. Now we stay here. Open your arms to a T position. Knee flexion. Grab your ankle. Lower the chest down for a rocking prep. We inhale, lifting up. Exhale, return. Three more times. Inhale, hip extension, back extension. Knee extension, lifting, exhale, two more, in breath, don't forget to squeeze the ball, exhale, last one, and inhale, send the pubic bone down to the floor, hip extension, back extension, then can we get more knee extension, and come on down, release the ball, all right, hands to the side, arms to the side of your shoulder, push up to your rest position. And just sit down onto the heels for a moment. Take an in-breath. Exhale. Two more breath. Last one. Let's roll up. Okay, all right, let's do some mermaids. So I have my right leg in front of me, which is your left. Sitting up nice and tall. Okay, let's put the ball some way away from your pelvis. Arms out to the side. Grow tall. We're going to lengthen. I'm going to pull it away a little bit more. Now lengthen and lower. Reach out. Keep the spine long, rotate, and open, and come up. Again, we lengthen out diagonally, reach out a little bit more, and rotate. We open back, face me, and come back up. Last two. And reach, and twist, rotate. Keep the spine long here in rotation. Opening the arms, face me, and come up. Last one. And twist, open, and come back up. All right, let's switch. Sitting nice and tall here. To start, arms out to the side. And we go, lean. And rotate. And open. Come back up. And tip down, reach out. And twist and open and come back. Two more. Lean away and rotate. Open upright. Last one. And lean away. Rotate. 
open and come back. Excellent. All right, let's grab the ball. Sit in open diamond leg position here. We're going to finish the class. Lifting up nice and tall. Have the ball in front of you here. Take an in breath. As we exhale, we roll down through the spine as we roll the ball away with you. As slow as you can to the floor. In breath. Exhale. We roll back up and we sit nice and tall. Exhale, nodding the head down, followed by the neck, upper back, middle back, lower back, and hinging the pelvis forward as you go deeper into the hip flexion. In breath. Exhale, rolling up through the spine. Nice and tall. Last one. Exhale. As we go down. In breath. Exhale. We roll up. Roll up. Roll up. Close the feet. Bring the ball in front of the chest here. Again. Sitting nice and tall. We in breath. As we exhale, press the ball, lifting the pelvic floor, the deep transverse abdominis, drawing the abdominal in. And release two more times. Inhale. Exhale. Again, in breath. Exhale. Let's do one more time. Inhale. I did say three. Let's do an extra one. Exhale. And let it go. Thank you. Thank you so much for completing the whole class with me. You're a star. I wish you a lovely day and take care. Well done on completing this class. You're a star. I'm Mira and I'm here to help you to love, look and feel your absolute best through Pilates. If you enjoyed this video, you will love my free six day intermediate challenge. Click the first link in the comments and join us in getting fit, strong and feel energized with a calendar of new intermediate Pilates videos. This six day challenge is taken from my 28 days intermediate Pilates program. If you would like to join the full 28 days, you'll find a link to my Flow With Mirror online membership in the description. See you in the next class.